Yeah, Shalom, Shalom, brothers, back again. I just got one scripture to pull. And um, this is pretty much just dealing with, you know, the, the kingdoms, the, the, the rulers of this earth. You know, a lot of us think that the rulers of the earth are going to continue on forever. You know, they're not going to continue on forever. You know, they, these 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 leaders have been set up by God. All right, so let's just jump into it. Isaiah 31 and 1, we're going to read to 3. Woe to them that go down to Egypt for help and stay on horses and trust in chariots because they are many and in horsemen because they are very strong. But they look, but they look. Not unto the Holy One of Israel, neither seek the Most High. You see what I'm saying? So that's talking about those who are running to Egypt. What's Egypt? America. Or any westernized structure that you may be living in. Talking about you Israelites, you so-called Negroes out there. Okay, don't run to America. Don't run to Europe. Don't run to the UK for help in these, in these, in these tragic times. Run to the Most High. You understand? Don't put your trust in this system. Okay? I'm hearing that brothers are running to Esau for help in these times. You know what I mean? No, you don't run. You don't run to Esau. You run to the Most High. You seek the Most High. He's going to deliver you and your families in these times. Okay? So we got to put this right back in its proper perspective. You understand? Because see, when the, when the heat come and the destruction come, you understand? You know, you know what I mean? All you folks out there are, are, are basically tucking your tails behind, in, behind yourself, so to speak. Okay? You can't do that. Got to stand strong. Second verse. Yet, he also is wise. And will bring evil, okay? The Most High is bringing these things. He's the wise one. And will not call back his words, cunt. But will arise again, the house of the evil doers. And against the, and against the help of them that work iniquity, cunt. So the evil doers is talking about the wicked among us. Dealing with our people also, and Esau. But predominantly Esau, he's the wicked one. Okay, Esau, Edom. He's the wicked one, okay? That's why you see the destruction and the plagues out here because the most high is finally getting this place prepped for the for further destruction okay the most high is prepping this place and and, and and laying it down doing what he has to do to this place and destroying this place and even destroying our people in it within 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 what he is doing okay and there's nothing wrong with that because our people are wicked okay so he's the most high is rising up against the house of evil doers even you, even you wicked dudes in these camps, you leaders and you elders and you apostles and you bishops, you priests out there, so-called priests, okay? Rabbi this and rabbi that. You're working iniquity, okay? But this is talking about Esau, okay? And those who, who, who are helping them, you understand? You strengthen in this empire. You can't strengthen this empire, neither can you run to it for help. Third verse, now the Egyptians are men. Come on, these, these, these rulers and people you see up here, these politicians and, and governors and mayors and, and presidents, so on and so forth, right? They're men, okay? They, they you know, they've been set up by the Most High, read none, and not God. Come, they're not gods, okay? They don't sit on the throne of the Most High. They don't sit on the left or right hand side of the, of the Most High. God is in control of these men, okay? When you read Job nine twenty four, it says the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. God has given them the power. God has given them the scepter. God has given them the, the authority. Okay, God has given them the endurance to rule with power. Okay, so at the end of the day, but the Most High gonna bring them down, as you can see, with these plagues and pestilences that He has brought upon the earth. Okay, so it says, "Now the Egyptians are men and not God, con, and their horses flesh, con, and not spirit." When the Most High shall stretch out His hand, both He that helpeth shall fall, con. So you can't help. You got you, you Israelites out there talking about, well, Israelites in the world talking about, see, you got to get within the system to, to help better the system, to help strengthen the system. No, 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 no. It don't work like that. You can't be a part of this beast system. Okay. You can't be a part of this beast system. This is the, this is a base system, a wicked, evil system. And you can't help it. You can't strengthen it. And we're not supposed to help it. We're not supposed to be running out voting. Okay. The scripture said, if you're voting, you're supposed to vote. For, for a person of your country, of your nation, of your kind. You understand? You ain't supposed to vote for no damn Barack Obama and, 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 and Hillary and, and Trump and all this foolishness. Okay? This has nothing to do with us. We're supposed to serve our King Christ. Yahweh Shah, the King of the Jews. Okay? Read none. And he that is hoping shall fall down. Come. So this kingdom is going to fall down. You can't help this man. You can't help this empire. Okay? You got people talking about, yeah, you, you see, you, you we got to help, we got to help people, we got to volunteer to help this, this, the corona thing, we got to help volunteer to help 
you know, slow down this corona. No, 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 no. We ain't supposed to help Bonte nothing. Okay? And that's the point with you Israelites, man. You Israelites out there. You you Negroes out there in the, in the world. You know, you so quick to help strengthen this empire as it's fallen. You understand? You 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 putting a hindrance before this whole thing, man. You hindering the destruction. You hindering the plagues. You hindering the pestilences there are. Okay? Because you want to help build this and strengthen this empire. You're going to go off. You're going off. And God is going to deal with you for that. Okay? And they all shall fall together, shall fail together. Come so even though you're strengthening this empire, you running up there trying to go to university to become some kind of mayor, some, some type of lawyer or something, which is nothing wrong being a lawyer, but you trying to be a governor, you trying to run for mayor, you trying to vote in this empire. Okay? You talking about you can change it from the inside on out. No, you, you can't do that. Because this empire is going to crumble and it's going to fall. You understand? So with that, Charlotte won.